Let's run it back. What you doing? Welcome to Adventure Gaming HQ, and welcome back to another Minecraft Pocket Edition video. Oh goodness gracious, today we have here a really cool vanilla trick in MCPE. Hello, chicken. It's very simple and easy. Today I'm going to show you how to create a shower in Minecraft Pocket Edition. This thing is absolutely everywhere on the internet, although all the videos that I've seen don't have very many views. So as I think I know, no big YouTubers have reviewed this yet, but there is a bunch of small videos on YouTube, which makes it really hard for me to find the original creator, but the OG, the, the homie who made this boy you good if you can find the original creator to this uh this really 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 cool trick go ahead and tell me in the comment section below but anyways let's go ahead and take a look at this shower's features let me show you its features okay so first things first as all of us know first of all you got to get naked to go into the shower <laughs> so we need to have a participant to uh get inside of there okay go ahead chicken go ahead and go inside oh come back okay so in instead this cow is going to volunteer oh come on come on get in there get in there oh we're almost there we're almost there Okay, so finally that we have uh, the cow inside of the shower, I can now show you how it works. So basically all you have to do is you have to turn it on. Oh, where'd the lever go? There, you go ahead and turn it on, and as you can see, a shower head turns- Oh, look at that, he even walks into it. A shower turns on, and water sprinkles down. Now, obviously, this is probably the best shower trick I've seen, like, ever. It actually looks like water's falling down, and the other ones I've seen before, it's kind of like bubbles and just weird things, like, like maybe water pouring on top of your hair, head, literally. But this is actually sprinkling water onto its subject. The cat loves it so much, he's, he's still just standing there. Just shows how quality content. I make. Uh. Okay, go ahead and get out, cow. It's my turn. Just as easily, <laughs> he's trying to get back into it. Just as easily, you turn it on. You can go ahead and turn it off just by flicking it, just like that. You can toggle it on and off really, really, really easily. And so now that you've seen it, let's go ahead and learn how it's done. It's actually very, very simple. All it's done with is a command block. That's what the secret sauce to this is. So let me show you how this command works. So first of all, you need a command block, which if you don't know how to, all you have to do is do slash give at p command underscore block, just like that, and it'll give you command block block just like this in my hand then you go ahead and place it wherever you want I'm just gonna place it in the ground right here then you want to tap on it first you want to turn it into repeat then you want to go ahead and go into the command input and put in this command slash set block three squiggly lines except the, the second one has a three next to it then you put water then zero then destroy now in those three squiggly lines the reason why there's a three on there is because that's saying that it's gonna be three blocks above where this command block is so if you count one two it will be right here on the third one. So when we go ahead and power it on, as you can see, it turns that into a water fountain. It's actually quite graceful. It's it's actually really cool. Now be careful. Whenever you update the block around this uh, weird water block, it's ju it's just it's just standstill water. So when you break a block next to it or you place a block next to it, it will actually turn into running water. Now let's go ahead and make it just like how I did over there. If you want to watch this, you go ahead. You can. If you want to, if you don't, then go ahead, then bye bye. I didn't like you anyways. <laughs> First of all, you want to break a 3 by 4 block hole just like this and fill it up with a uh uh, 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 block of quartz. Then go ahead and add an L just like this on the outside of it. Then go ahead and make a second layer. And then finally, a third layer. Now you just want to go over to this block right here and break this one. Then just continue with a fourth layer on top of that. And then you go back here and you add one, two, three, four blocks. And over here on top, you want to add a, uh, a little bit of a, you know, roof. Then you add glass panes just like that. And then finally, all you have to do is place a lever right there. Now you have yourself a nice shower in Minecraft Pocket Edition. Now actually, I made this one a little bit bigger than this one, so you can you can downsize it if you want. I don't know why I made this one a little bit bigger. But that was how to create a water fountain, or a uh, shower, or any kind of other sprinkling water source you want in Minecraft PE. That's all, people. Thank you so much for watching. Feel free to rate, comment, and subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos.